last of our three hour extravaganza. Uh, okay, we are back with our, I think this is our final item of Cook's Essentials. Um, and a, an item that I love, <laughs> I have to tell you. Chef Aaron and I have presented this together more than once and we have a blast every time. Last time we sold out of one of the colors, one of the two colorways. So this is the stainless steel four piece mixing bowl set. It looks like one. <coughs> But that's because it's nestable. It's coming home for $34, $11.33 on your easy pay, K49572. What you're gonna get? You're going to get a one and a half quart mixing bowl in this really pretty gold color. Whoop, sorry, I went too fast. You're gonna get the three quart mixing bowl in this beautiful bronze coppery color. You're gonna get the five quart in this sort of gunmetal stainless steel. And then the big daddy right here, this is eight quarts. Look at this, it's massive. It has non-slip bottoms. You use this for hot things, you use this for cold things. Oh, and I don't know if you can see, but there's even some measurement lines on the eight quart in there. Kind of hard to see, but maybe I think you guys can do it. So if you are making whipped cream and, and you need to store it in the fridge, it'll keep it nice and cold. If you are doing some double boiling, it's perfect for this. This is called the Metallics. We used to have Brights, but Chef Aaron and I sold out of those next last time. I love the Metallics though. All right, Chef Aaron, how much do we love these mixing bowls? This is like our date night. And it's all about the bowls, right? <laughs> Yes, hey, babe, how you feeling tonight? I don't know. You feeling like gunmetal or Big Dad? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> just don't know. These bowls are I the last mixing bowls you are ever going to need. That is the beginning and end of this presentation because that's the truth. That's how I feel about these bowls. I just can't say enough about these bowls. And I've dealt with a lot of bowls over my 30-something years in the kitchens of hotels, casinos, you name it. But no bowl really has done it like this because you mentioned hot or cold. Like I literally, I don't know if you can see the steam coming from this. Yeah. But you can sit this over a water bath to melt your chocolate to do chocolate covered strawberries or whatever. And it, hey, make your hollandaise if you want because you have that heat resistant silicone bottom that's non-stick and this bowl, which I'm gonna let you know now, do not put in the dishwasher because it doesn't go in the dishwasher. It's okay. too pretty to put in the dishwasher. It's an easy wipe down, clean up. I don't think you're making concrete or anything or cement in this thing, so you don't <laughs> want to go that route. But you do want to go the route to use it in so many different ways. I wanted to show you what happens with this bowl right here. Tell me what's going on. Slipping and sliding. This bowl is sliding, right? It's like having socks on a wax floor. And that's not what we want. I wanted something like this. Now, I can't slide this because if I push it too hard, it will tilt. But I can tell you what I can do, hands-free, I'm normally having someone come in the kitchen and help me hold the bowl while I'm making a vinaigrette or hollandaise. Yeah. And I'm looking for a way to do both without the bowl sliding all over the place. Well, we have the answers here with Cook Essentials because we got a hands-free bowl. Like we had the hands-free can opener. Now you can go ahead and build your dressings, build your hollandaise. You can add different ingredients to making breads without having to hold the bowl because it does it by itself with this non-stick, which I love the most. And also, what is, Julia, this is a test. What is this bowl missing? You already got the fact that it slides. What is missing? Tell me. The lip. Oh, girl. Pretty and smart. You got the package. <laughs> da, da, Look at the da. lip on this. <laughs> Can you believe this? I mean, the lip is so gracious to your hands. Yes. And I have medium-sized, large-sized hands, but the fact that I can literally Grab this bowl and you have nails. And yep. how do you tell me how does it feel with nails and to hold this bowl? Super easy. And they're super lightweight as well. I have to throw that out there. So lightweight. Yeah. But also I can carry it this way. If it's something hot in there, I feel like yeah. I can protect my hands and my nails. Yes. Yes. And you got the fact that you have that height, you have the width, you have the lip. Now we gotta talk about the real thing, the size. Now I I saw you show that they have the measurements in milliliters and in cups. But when we're talking about size, I want to just talk to you about this. This is a 10 pound turkey. I don't know if oh. you can see this or not. And normally when you run out of space and come to holiday times or any time of the year, I like to smoke a turkey outside about this time of the year. You're taking it out the freezer and you want to thaw it the proper way. Your refrigerator is packed. Well, I always suggest folks to put cold water 
and your frozen bird in there or whatever your frozen, your frozen meat that you're going to put on the grill, your briskets, your butts, whatever it might be, and let it thaw in this bowl. But look at how deep and big this bowl mm -hmm. is that you could put a 12-pound turkey in this bowl, and I can hold this by the lip. Yep. And the bowl is ice chill. So if you're making whipped cream and you want a cold bowl fast, that's what you're going to get. If you want a bowl that's going to hold the heat, you're going to get that. And I got to show you this little tip right here, Julia. I don't know about you, but I'm a fruit lover. Yes. And I hate warm fruit. Ugh. But you can go ahead and get you one of those store-made fruit trays. Put your ice in the bottom of that bowl. Oh. Sit this right on the top. No one will know. You got your cold bowl on it, but this thing is so ice. I just need a cocktail right now. Oh my goodness, I'm gonna have a cocktail with this. You can feel the coldness of this bowl and it's gonna last you for a couple of hours just having ice and having that fruit nestled in that bowl. Well, That's you, gonna be the bonus. You could also Talking. do that for a shrimp cocktail, couldn't you? Couldn't you? It's like, you could go any size on the shrimp cocktail because we got the one and a half, we got the three, we got the five, and we got the eight quart size bowl. Eight quart. You can build yourself a whole bunch of barbecue in this bowl. You can bake your breads and proof your breads in this bowl. Oh yeah. I like to use these bowls honestly when I go to pick in my garden and I don't want to pick anything else out there that's going to crack or break. I take the largest one out there and I start picking peppers, tomatoes, Brussels sprouts, whatever's in season that I'm picking. I always take this bowl out there with me and the fact that it doesn't move and it doesn't slide. I had a little birdie in my ear before we came on. He said, I really like those bowls. They don't slide. Yep. Look at this. Look I at really me, like these bowls I'm doing too. my sit up. I'm push up. I'm leaning and pushing this bowl <laughs> and it's not going anywhere. This isn't because I got great sneakers on either. <laughs> this is just a very good sturdy bottom that allow you to really have fun in the kitchen. And I don't know what else to all say. All the sizes that you could possibly need. And I love the metallics. I was, I thought the metallics oh, yes. were gonna be the first ones to go, but yeah. we were mistaken. It was the brights, but we still have look it in the, the metallics. Colors. Get them before they're gone. Like we said, this is, like, look at the, look at your mixing bowls now. Are they dented? Are they dingy? Are they not fun? Yeah. Cause they don't have any like cool colors in them. This is the moment because it's on a great price of $34 for all four with the non-slip with the lip. You get the eight quart, you get the five quart, you get the three quart. Oh, that has measuring on it too. And you get the one and a half quart, all mixing bowls, all nesting. So cool, I love them. K49572, 1133 on your easy pay. Chef Aaron, we did it again. Julia, I just love hanging out with you, girl. Have a great rest of the day, and I'm gonna get eating and cleaning and cooking in these bowls. All right, you get at it, and I will see you soon. See you later, baby. Have a all good right, one. Bye. Speaking of Cooks Essentials, this has been so popular in our show. Like